Now, it's Skin Cancer Action Week, and despite being the melanoma capital of the world, about half of all Aussies have never had a professional skin check. So with summer on our doorstep, we've been encouraged to get serious about sun protection. Gary Callahan found out the hard way just how damaging the sun can be. I had a small lump, and um, it was irritating me, and uh, I was putting my hand around and feeling it. But a little off to the left, I found uh, that there was something else that was uh, rough and irritating. So I had my wife look at it, and she discovered that it was a darkened mole. And lucky he did. The mole turned out to be melanoma, the deadliest form of skin cancer. The specialist said that the depth was uh, 1.7, and that the prognosis, he said, was he probably got about an 80% survival rate with it. The Cancer Council has released some scary statistics today. Two men over 45 die of melanoma every day. And guys over 45 are twice as likely to die from the disease as women of the same age. The message is, watch your backs. We know blokes are generally pretty slow at presenting to the GP and, and have that, oh, she'll be right attitude. Um, so that early detection of melanomas is critically important. But melanoma has a high survival rate if detected early. If we can get those melanomas early, the chance of survival after five years is really high, around 90%. But if you present late, uh, melanoma is very insidious as a disease. It can spread right throughout the body and cause all sorts of um, trauma. Although melanoma can develop anywhere on the body, when it comes to men, it's mostly on their back. It was a huge wake-up call for Gary. It's frightening. You know, it really is frightening. And I think the fact that I've overlooked it for all these years and not had a skin specialist look at me is really crazy. When Gary got the, the result, it was, it was devastating. You get to this stage of your life where you're ready to enjoy your, you know, enjoy retirement and your grandchildren and all that sort of thing. And, you know, and you don't want to do it without your partner. Experts say detecting melanoma is about noticing changes to the skin. It's really looking for those spots that are changing in shape, colour or size. So it is important to yeah, look for those spots that you know, it, 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 often people feel oh, something's not quite right. It's taking this advice that saved Gary's life. I feel lucky because the fact that I went and saw the doctor and look, I keep saying it's a men thing, you know, I'll go next week, I'll go next week. I think, you know, in two or three weeks or four weeks, it would have totally been a different scenario. Prevention is the best form of cure. And I, I can't express enough how important it is for everyone to get checked out. I mean, obviously, Gary's middle-aged. I was 19 and I had a melanoma. My mum had been urging me for months to go. Uh, when I finally did go to the doctor, he said that if it had been three months later, they would have chopped my foot off. Six months later, I would have not even had much chance of survival. That so just, wow. It just looked a bit out of... Just but a out little of bit out of kilter. I was 19. I, you know, I and thought on your that foot too. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. But um, do get yourself checked out because it definitely saved my life. Yeah, yeah. And don't second guess it. No. If you're worried about it, just go and get it checked. If they say it's nothing, that's a great thing. Mm. We'll stay here, and you'll be back after the break. Yeah.